Hey kitty. Wow. <sighs> well, um, just a uh, quick message out to Kim Il Sung and uh, North Korean Democratic Party. That's uh, probably too deep, too dark to get those. <clears throat> Kind of running behind here. So we'll make it quick so it doesn't take days and days to upload before the useless pricks at Blang Corporation <coughs> tell the rest of Mossad what to tell the American government what to do with my Canadian communications. Huh? Uh, so, uh, yeah, uh, anyhow, on, on with the point. Um, yeah, it's this bullshit going on in Ukraine. It's, um, given the fact that NATO was compromised, clearly, we've seen what happened. Can't be trusted, the global Zionist own it, as they do China. <clears throat> and, well, it's obvious that even though Russia is the second in line stakeholder in this whole Ukraine affair, uh, <clears throat> regardless of what the facts are, the peace needs to be restored. Uh, North Korea. I would invite all Ukrainians of concern to make your replies known here, or I'll put the links there to uh, Kim's channel. And I'll do my best to make sure that somehow or another he gets all your uh, invitations to intervene. And basically, I know he's got the manpower. Uh, I'm sure if he had the fuel and the spare parts for that old Russian crap, they would be happy to uh, maybe uh, fly over a few loads of uh, peacekeepers. Just like the UN was supposed to do, but you know, they're compromised by the same global Zionist cocksuckers and uh, can't be trusted with even their own existence, let alone somebody else's welfare or, you know, that of my earth. So, uh, Those seeing that, uh, share your thoughts. Um, I mean, I can't think of anyone else more equipped that needs uh, the cash and the training and the goodwill amongst the earth, uh, a way for you know a, a, a peace offering, shall we say, uh, than uh, North Korea. Um, if I can get uh, with a lot of help from uh, my viewers and subs and and whatnot, if I can get the word to the Ukrainians and enough of them consent and give you an official invitation and, you know, something, whatever they can offer in trade besides pierogies and gigantic Asanoff cargo lifters and all that other shit. Um, fuck, let's do it, man. I'm sure you could have the whole thing fucking wrapped up and settled and most of your troops right the fuck back home in time for spring plant. Anyone else got any better ideas? Put them down here. Okay. Peace out. Live as long as you fucking can. And, um... Don't prosper at the expense of others. You'll find it ain't sustainable. Terminal competition never is. I would say go ask this species and that species and that species. And, but, well, they're extinct. Just like the vast majority of Homo sapiens are about to be extinct. Through their own fucking covetous greed and... Oh, you don't want to marry outside of the family! Oh, well, okay, you got to do that because everyone's turning out double-headed and... And, and sterile and dying. You, you can't marry outside of the gene pool! What, what the fuck? You're all fucking talking monkeys. Even though our H negative ones. <clears throat> You're all a bunch of fucking mutants. Just, just through your bad breeding practices, you're pretty well extinct to yourself. Never mind all the fucking Agenda 21 soft kill and the nuking and whatnot. That you squandered most of your surplus survival resources on exterminating yourself. <clears throat> it's amazing how the guilty conscience works, huh? Okay. So, anyhow, uh... If 
everyone is uh, concerned about enough about their own survival, here's a good place to start. Get the word out to North Korea and get it to Kim and get it to the uh, all all Ukrainians, domestic and foreign, and see if they want to uh, hire some peacekeepers, some impartial peacekeepers. The only thing they uh, got to lose is their existence like everyone else. They have no interest in either side. And uh, I think um, the North Koreans have done a pretty good job of resisting being bought under the most desperate and tempting, cruel, vicious, and unusual punishments that the world could muster up at the beckoning of the global Zionist pricks <clears throat> that just want to force everybody to buy their military industrial complex crap tech that couldn't really fight their way out of a paper bag but you sure as the hell could defend yourself against outraged slaves that you know uprisings okie doke catch you later we'll keep this short